gonna be a what's on my iPhone 11 Pro 2020 edition. Plus, I'm gonna be showing you guys my iPhone case collection. So, um, let's start with some wildflower cases. I am literally obsessed with wildflower. I love wildflower so much. I love it. But they're kind of expensive, so I can't be just like, whenever I want one, I'll just get one. Okay, so before I had my 11 Pro, I had my Fun X and I had like this really pretty butterfly one. I already sold it, so I can't show you. So I'll put like a picture. So now I have the 11 Pro and I have three wildflower cases. Okay, so this first one is just like the cheetah leopard print one and I put a black pop socket on it. I don't know, I just thought it'd be nice. By the way, this is not sponsored. Sadly. Oh, and then this one, I actually, it's from Wildflower, but um, you can get it on Urban Outfitters. And this is Yeehaw. And like, uh, I mean, do I gotta really say anything about it? Like, it's just so cute. And it's literally me because... Uh, I don't know. Anyways, so, and then I finally got this one. My brother got me this for my birthday. Um, I love it because it has this... Um, like this neon pink flames and it's just so cute because I don't know if you can tell by my room which by the way room tour coming up very very soon um I love the color pink so now we're moving on to the apple silicone cases which I am obsessed with so much and I love them okay so the first one is we have this red one it's they're all from apple by the way it's a silicone one love it then it's this one these are also one of my favorite colors um, we have a really pretty aqua one, and we have a yellow one, oh, it's so cute, and we finally have, like, this nice soft color one. Next case that I want to show you, it's from Caseify. Caseify cases are really, really cute and protective, so Caseify, whenever I get famous, hopefully this blows up, you can sponsor me and send me some cases if you want. Just saying. But um, I got this one um, for my birthday as well. It's super protective and like it's super hard to like, like this doesn't even move. Like it, it's like, like, <laughs> I'm not explaining it. These both are from Otterbox, I'm pretty sure, or Spec. I don't know, like those cases are really protective. So this one, here it is. I don't know if you could tell, but it's really, it's not dirty, it's glittery. It's glittery. And this one um, is just the one I first got from my phone when I first got it. Um, this was the first case, and I just put the sticker that I got from Brandy Mobile. So focus. Okay, it's not going to focus. I don't care. Oh, in this case, I just wanted to add it. This is my mom's, though. Honestly, bef I'm kind of upset because... Oh, wait, I'm going to sound like a brat. But when I changed from an iPhone X to my iPhone 11 Pro... Um, like, I lost all my really cute iPhone um, X cases, and they were, I had a lot, and they are really cute, but we sold them, so it was worth it, I guess. I'm not trying to brag, but um, I know a lot of my friends, like, just noticed that I have a lot of cases, so I just wanted to show you guys my cases. Without further ado, let's get um, on to what's on my iPhone. Okay, so my lock screen is pretty much just a collage of a bunch of cute pictures that I put together because they're pretty much my aesthetic, I guess you could say. I don't know. So they're opened up. This is the first page. It literally has all the basic Apple apps and green light. Green light is like an app where you can control your money on your credit card but like it's its own company like I have a green light credit card where my mom can just transfer money when I need it in an emergency or you know but it's pretty much a credit card for kids and it's super easy and it's it's the best so I recommend getting a green light card 
Then I have files, Gmail, Google Photos. Google Photos, I 100% recommend, especially if you're like me, you're constantly taking photos and videos, and you don't want to delete them just because you're running out of storage. Google Photos will save your photos and allow you to delete them from the Photos app and have you, or let you have more storage on your phone. So yeah, and then Google Drive and Outlook. Outlook is just my email for my school. Now I have um, the four main ones on like the bottom tab, I guess you could say, are call, messages, FaceTime, and WhatsApp. WhatsApp can be used like if you're going to make a group chat, you can't have your Android users on the group chat because it does, Apple doesn't allow that. So you can make group chats on WhatsApp. Also, my family uses WhatsApp a lot, so I just use it too. Next, we have in this tab, it's called Inspo. Pretty much, it's just photo editing and photo inspiration. You know, so obviously we have Pinterest. You guys can go follow my Pinterest. I swear, I'm not obsessed with the high powers. That I don't have a Pinterest board just because it's it's for something else. If you know, you know. Anyway, so I have all these really um cool and really pretty and really inspiring. Uh, inspiring, but like. Just like go on my Pinterest and follow me because I have really good ones and me and Lexa have this hot girl summer Pinterest board so you guys can go follow all of these and yeah follow me. Now we have Visco. I freaking I don't care. Freaking call me a Visco girl. I honestly don't care because guess what? I don't care. Like Visco is an app for editing. It has photo inspiration. See, like, this is cute, like, I think just people, see, like, look at this, and you can, like, repost images. The good thing about Visco is it's not anything toxic, like, Instagram, like, you don't see how many followers you have, there's no likes, you can't compare your likes and comments to anybody else, it's literally just a platform where you get to post your photos, so, yeah, and this is my Visco account, so go follow me. Um, I don't know. I don't really have that good of a feed, if I'm being honest. But, um, yeah. Next, we have Tezza. I know, you know, okay, if you've ever seen those really, really cute and aesthetic, like, um, rooms with, like, the pretty wallpaper, that's Tezza. That's Tezza, like, the wallpaper stuff. And she also has this editing app. I actually just got it the other day because I saw it on a TikTok of how people edit their photos. So I was like, let me try that out. But I haven't taken any photos yet, so. But I'm going to use that in the future. Next tab, I call it Watch. So I have YouTube, Netflix, Disney Plus, and Amazon. So YouTube, go follow me on YouTube. And this is currently on my main channel. So go follow my vlog channel. Um, I have Netflix. I... <clears throat> I love Netflix. Netflix is my life. I sound so, maybe you call me lazy. I literally love Netflix. Like, my favorite shows, which are, I call me basic, whatever, is Gossip Girl and Vampire Diaries. If you're gonna get Netflix, you you have to watch both of them. Like, I finished Gossip Girl and I don't even know like what, what to do now. Like, do I rewatch it or like, cause I'm trying to like, like just watch all the Netflix shows that you can name. And I pretty much watch every Netflix show there is because I'm obsessed. Um, it's kind of a problem. Next, I have Disney Plus. I actually don't really use Disney Plus. Like, I would use it once in a while when I'm like bored of Netflix, which never happens because Netflix is life, you know. So, Disney Plus is there. It's I I appreciate having it though. Zoom. I go on really fun Zoom calls with my friends. I school is over and we we didn't use zoom we use like another platform um now we have editing as you guys can tell i don't have a mac so i don't really edit my videos on there because like i'll just edit it on my phone because i already know the tips and tricks on their iphones or whatever so i have qcup pro which is what how i edit my videos some people do imovie uh i don't know i don't know what you use just whatever and then we have characters you probably like okay so characters is like you can have all these really cute like designs or whatever and you just if you see everybody like you know all those stars that everybody uses in their captions or bios and stuff like that they get it from here all you have to do is select all copy and let's just pretend this is somewhere else and you just have to paste it and you just paste you can do it as many times as you want and 
and yeah. So next I have Mega Photo, and then I have um, Camera Connect, which is how I transfer my um, footage from my camera to my iPhone to edit. I have Lightroom. Lightroom is pretty much just, it's like Visco, but I've bought in like presets. See, I was just editing my sister's photo. But I've bought in presets. I edit my disposable photos on here. Just like sometimes fix the exposure and stuff like that. Next I have airbrush. Just a basic like, I'm not gonna lie. Like if my skin is like, see I have an allergic reaction right now. So if I were to take photos, I wouldn't want that, like, so I just smooth it out. But not too much to the point where I look, like, fake and plastic and, like, so I just say, like, subtle. Because, I don't know, I just feel insecure about that, you know? Oh. So next I have Pixar. Pixar, I use that. You probably know what that is. Um, it's to, I use it to edit my thumbnails if I ever want to add something. I don't know, like, just... I don't know, just go watch a video on Pixar to see what it is. Eraser is a really good app. Okay, I deleted all my photos, but let's say you just want the face of... Just the faces, right? So I go to... Oh, frick. So you go to Erase, and you go Target Color, and you just... And then now you, all you have is just the faces, or whatever you just want, and it's really easy to erase the background. It becomes a PNG. You can put it anywhere. I hope I explained that good. Next I have Prequel. Prequel became pretty popular off of, um, what's it called, TikTok, because it has all those pretty effects with like the videos where it's like pink and all the bling and whatever. Okay, next I also have Fonto. Fonto is where I get all my fonts, and I also use these for use Fonto for the thumbnail. YouTube Studio is really great. Um, it helps me keep track of my videos, even though I'm not even making money off of them, so it doesn't really matter. But, um, yeah, just look at this, so. I mean, I have 1.4K watch time minutes, so I guess that's good. Um, I have SoundCloud. I listen to, like, remixes of songs. Like, I find them and I put them in, like, my videos. So, if you've ever heard, like, a remix song on my YouTube, it's from SoundCloud. iMovie I use because, um, it helps, allows me to use green screens. Okay. Insect Share. Next, I have this tab of random. I have house party, which is just like where I keep getting my notifications from. Um, it's just like a FaceTime type of, no, it's not. Well, it's like FaceTime and Zoom, you know, but you can like play games on there, you know. Sheen, everybody shops at Sheen. YOLO, um, it's kind of cringy that I still put YOLOs on my story. Um, I don't know why I do that. Okay, and I have DoorDash because that's how I get all my food to my house. Um, Airbnb, we use that a lot. Um, guitar tuna, oh, it's for my ukulele to tune it. Co-star, oh, it, this is, okay, so, call me crazy, but I low-key agree in, like, I'm not always on this app, so. I low-key agree with, like, astrology and zodiac signs and all that stuff. I feel like that's low-key real. Maybe it's just me, because I'm stupid or whatever. But, like, even when I go on Instagram on those accounts, when the stuff they say about, like, Aries, I feel like it's so true. So, I'm like, okay, this has to be accurate in some way. I don't think this would be so popular if it wasn't real. Like, you know? Or maybe, I don't know. Next, I have Roblox, because Roblox is life. I'm just kidding. I like Roblox. Add me on Roblox. Next, I have Photo Roulette. Photo Roulette is a really fun but kind of scary game, depending on what you have on your camera roll. Pretty much, you play with friends, and it just picks out a random photo from your camera roll, and people have to guess whose photo it is. And yeah. Next, I have Shop. Okay, I have Poshmark, where I like to sell my clothes. And before I found out about Depop, um, I used to just use Poshmark, but now I found out about Depop, so I'll sell my stuff on there now. Um, Amazon because Amazon is they like li literally it'll save my life for anything um, Shutterflies where like everybody gets their like printed pictures from I have logins because that's how I get my photos printed out CVS in case I want to get my photos printed out there um, Like to know is a really good app. I see a really cute outfit that you on Instagram But you don't know where the outfit is actually from this app will tell you exactly where the items are from So that's really cool Snapfish, it's the same thing as Shutterfly. And Open Table is pretty much for dinner reservations. My mom makes me do those for her, so. Next we have VIP, which is the ones I always use. I have TikTok, Snapchat, Spotify, um, Twitter, and Instagram. Here's my account. Go ahead, follow me, because I'm, 
I want to be TikTok famous and me the Kardashians like Addison Rae did so just follow my snapchat I'll like put it somewhere I don't know um, oh I have Spotify Spotify like this video if you think Spotify is better than Apple Music you can just follow me these are all my things follow my Spotify my music is pretty bomb I'm not even gonna lie um, I have Twitter I just got Twitter recently just to look on the like the tea on Charlie and Chase honestly um twitter i just don't really find it i don't know people just say what they think and think people are gonna care okay that's kind of rude but i'm just saying um instagram follow me on instagram guys <laughs> you can follow me um don't follow me follow me if you want um let's search it up dispose here it is it's my disposable account follow that too i'm not very good at disposables like, I'm not like, oh my god, they're gonna run this on the ball, you know, but um, I'm trying my best, and I think it's really, they're really cute, fun, and memorable, and, you know, when I go to a party, I just like take photos, and the disposable, so it's like really fun. Uh, so my next one are games. I have Jetpack, Subway Surf, Smashball Hit, Akinator, and Zombies Run. Okay, so Jetpack is a really old game, Subway Surf is a really old game, but like, Jay call me acting up. But this kid, Brody, <laughs> Brody, look, he reminds me of JJ from Outer Banks. Then I have, I also like, um, saw this on HB, it's called Zombies Run. Apparently it's like when you're running, you're on a run and you like put it in your head. It sounds like zombies are chasing you so it makes you run faster. I don't know, I was just, I just got it, you know. Literally pretty much it. Um, I have pretty like clean storage, so. Yeah, this is this is my boring what's on my iPhone video. Um, I hope you guys enjoy this video. Please make sure to subscribe and like. This is just like a video I wanted to put out there. Just fun. And yeah, I'll see you in my next video. Bye.